Alright. Now I just wait for people to join. You should not skip school, you know why? That's a virgin move. <laughs> Anyways, we wait for some more people. Um, the... You know, what we'll do in the stream is finalize the names of the characters, add more suggestions if required, and then their nicknames if uh, if people feel like it and then we discuss some background information about them which I should probably prepare her Just prepare some lines. Meh, fuck among us. You, you, you like these? These, these uh, creatures that uh, gave me 2.8 million? This is fucking stupid. Alright, so let's get these three. Put them in a the grid. And now why the hell would I even announce that? It's up to them to debate about it. I don't really care. Debates are funny. You just gotta watch them do it. Let's have a grid here. Honestly, I don't even know how many stabs I put. I was trying to make a 28, but uh, the audio and video do not count up together. Uh, yeah. Don't care. Get the characters. Here we got first pers general personality. And then on the last chat design we did some like uh are the characters related to each other but uh since that didn't really go well. I'll just narrow it down to. I mean, I'll just shorten it to. Ah, uh, this. Background info. Hello, okay, what am I doing now? Right now, I am. We're going to discuss the. the personality and. <coughs> the names of the characters. Looks like we only have uh, 
like one or two active people so we'll just wait a bit more screen is laggy today I wonder why <laughs> McDonald's Wi-Fi Alright, while waiting for some people, we could discuss some stuff such as the names for the characters. Pockets from there. I'm free. Oh, we need more people. Mm. But we can. You can suggest some things ahead of time. Like uh, we're going to do the personality in a, a Paul manner. So let's say one of the personalities I have in mind for her is why the hell is this at the front? Um, one of the personalities would be. Damn, I don't know anything for her. And then for this. Can you do a fan Jojo video again? I love this video and it have too much views. You know, just because something gets popular does not mean I myself like it. So oh, no. I don't wanna make But stuffing too many fucking Jojo references into one video is not funny Well if you find it funny, you have an illness Alright, I don't know any... I don't know any other personalities. I don't even know if this is considered plenty people. Like, is this enough people for me to start? is awfully quiet
I don't know what story are you talking about. I do not understand. Ready for touch grass. I, I don't fucking understand. Zach, you are horrible. Okay, Gustavo, we are finalizing the names of the characters and their personalities plus background information. I remember the last time when we did Ari and uh, Ari and Gimbo had to establish connections between those two and uh, yeah, connections between other characters, but. This time, no, I'm not doing that. It's uh, too much to do. Somewhat. Alright, for the pirate lady, Lady Fury, Baroness of the Seas. Honestly, I like that. Lady Fury, Baroness of the Seas. I'm spelling it wrong, am I? Yes, I am. I'm stupid. Furnace of the Seas. This man right here is an actual thoughtful guy. But then, when it comes to others, they, they're just in it for the booba and shit. Just making their ideal woman that does not exist. This is stick man, goddammit. I'm also curious what happens to Ryan's personality. She was a Kominaka, then became a full on cat girl. Why is the sudden change? I don't know. It just felt more. felt more entertaining, I guess. Poor Ohio Bucket Man, Buccaneer, <laughs> Master of Stonks. <laughs> Master of Stonks. These are nicknames, right? Just uh, confirming. Oh my god, my typing is horrible. Master of Stonks. Hell yeah. If you hire this man, you will become... Uh, your business will be booming. Wait, uh... Oh, double nicknames. Alvin Rocky, designer of war. Pretty good. Um, while at the beginning of the stream, I just inserted this uh, name Corb because someone suggested it. Just a suggestion. Buckchum. Is it a name or a nickname?
crab. Uh, okay, <laughs> crab instead. Kurt Cobain, yo, it's Kurt Cobain. Just get out of my face. Out, out. All right, where were we? Hmm. So uh, yeah, you can also suggest some uh, general personalities. Like I don't know what is she supposed to be. Like, do you want her to be a greedy type? Savage? A uh, tough woman? I always like tough women. And then uh, this guy, the literally Ohio, Ohio citizen. And uh, this guy, uh, he look grumpy. He look like he'll make you a sword and then stare at you while you swing it around in the wrong way and think you're a stupid idiot alright, easily enough pirate lady deserves to be strong and kind strong and kind oh and later on after we decide that we'll just put background information like throw in anything you want as long as it matches up with the uh, others then it would be acceptable. Okay, goofy. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Quite a suggestion. This is Ohio Secretary. Maybe. Oh, man's personality should just be Delta Room Cromer guy. Uh, since it's a suggestion, uh, don't give me chances because I'm all going all out on the background. Um, let me show you what happened in the previous chat design when it came to the background. Gustavo, what the fuck are you trying to make her depressed? Uh, chat design. Okay, so this is the first chat design. I'm pretty sure we have the info here. Ah, yes, here we are. So here are the two characters, Ari and Gimbo. So yeah, personality. The g the man is wholesome, but perceived as uh, scary because of his build. And then the other one is sarcastic mom and badass. And they are rival siblings. Blood siblings, somewhat half, kind of, I guess. I think I just call it half blood because of uh, you know, I gotta line up with the lore they were given. And then friends and other relations, we did not make much here. Oh yeah, I just established this on uh, through videos instead of text. And then yeah, there's lore here. These are information. You know, like uh, seventy percent of these, which is quite a majority. Uh yeah, this is. All right, this. Yeah, this part here, this whole part is uh. By one person, one viewer. And then here, yeah, he. Alright, I mean, none of this is by that per same person, but yeah, they pitched in ideas. And then here, some of them are from the same person, some of them are from other people, so yeah. Nothing's holding you back here, except uh, democracy. Oh right, yeah, let's go back here. Alright, since... Uh, Oh boy. So, uh, you know, the people who are so invested in their making the one character 
like just one character and they have so much information a lot of detail a lot of attention to it i respect that because for me i i i, I fucking suck want to see a an example of a uh, character writing for one of my characters <clears throat> okay so we just go here named these are the named guys now we just do a quick scroll and wow okay so it's this guy simple writing so this guy is based on uh, my attitude when I was in junior high grade 9 I believe uh, I hate my classmates so yeah, I made this person dislike his classmates um, he's only friends with a handful of people same thing for him I still do not know how to say his name properly despite me being the one who wrote it that uh, I'm stupid and then yeah basically this man's just based on my old self is he smart sometimes yes sometimes no if I'm going to base him on my current me man I'm flunking in my classes like ever since online classes I have been performing poorly so yeah uh, back then at least for this guy uh, yeah he's just you know average fellow introvert guy he hates people he hate, he hate people yeah yeah wait you rejected hot chicks at junior high what the fuck you mean I um I don't know as far as I'm concerned uh, whenever whenever I hear rumors or inf intel that a girl likes me back in high school my dumbass would confront them. Why? Because I'm I'm fucking immature. And what do I do? I pressure them into admitting it. For confirmation. And then what happens? Uh yeah, they lose interest. Very cool. I'm proud of myself. Because even right now I ain't looking for anything. I don't wanna. Nice for real, he just like, he just like me. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, I also, um, an initial part, like a for initial writing for this guy, um, he's one of my first characters, so, uh, what's this? I, I'm just took out the part where he's just, uh, giving bad aur auras. Keeping people away because uh, of his atmosphere. Like he has some nuclear radiation or something. Uh, actually, that's me in high school. Just uh, look at people with a clear sign indicating to them, fuck off, I don't want to talk with you. And yeah, that's just me. Um, The, the reason I do not like the people at my high school grade 9 and so forth um, I transferred there a grade 9 grade 9 grade 8 let's say grade 9 I came from Saudi Arabia okay I just transferred from there and I'm Filipino okay uh, so yeah m most of the people I come across it's either they make terrorist jokes or they make uh, you know, sultan jokes. None of them are funny. Like, even uh, dark humor is funnier than whatever they're saying. I can even make funnier terrorist jokes than them. They, they suck at it. And what's even worse, it's at a rural area. And you know, kids at the rural places, they are too realistic. And they're very hard to uh, bear with.
but uh, yeah, it's uh, the type of people I meet there are different from uh, Discord. Discord, English, at least they understand that I use English. But these province people, they, they really want to fuck around. I just say I can't speak, insert dialect. And they start speaking the dialect, yeah, fuck off, I don't like you. But yeah, that's about it. Uh, enough story time, since we have plenty of people. Let's say four. We should start. So... Which of the names do you like here? Honestly, Stilly Jane looks like a nickname. But uh, I'll leave it at that. Uh, the background information and description will go last, but for now, we'll, let's start with the names. So, there are four names suggested here. Matilda, Alex... I'm not even going to be mentioning the full name in videos. It's like, uh, you know, just like in cartoons, they just say the first name, they don't say the last name. Oh yeah. Matilda, Alex, Lucy, or Stilly. Actually, Lucy is an existing name, but, uh, meh. What you guys like? Lucy Lutenberg hits hard. I like Matilda. Alex. Wow, everybody having different, um, Opinions. Although, if you ask me, you see, I am tied between Matilda or Lucy. Those are some good names. Can we get a tiebreaker from uh, whoever else is in? I'm switching to Lucy. Okay, okay. Lucy wins by a landslide. Three votes. You wanna see the Lucy that exists? It's not actually a person, but uh, a split personality of one of my characters. One of my first characters. I think this is like my second female character that I named. Yeah, this is her. Uh, let me get the colored one. So yeah, she's, uh, you know, I've been reading a bit too much, uh, too much stuff, like, uh, them comics read on YouTube, so yeah, yeah, she's a fighter, like a brute force type of thing, so yeah, simple writing. That girl from the video. What video? What video? <laughs> oh, whatever. Um, anyways. Would you guys like a nickname? Say yes. For yes. And no for no. While well, I'm waiting. Um. Uh, wait, I think I saw her in a collab. Oh, yes, you did. Uh, she appeared in, uh. Stuntman collab Number two? Yeah, Stuntman 2 Where uh, I made her do some fucking uh, Lydia Sobieska Shit Or you know, just some uh, Karate in general Okay, one wants a nickname You want nickname? Give her nickname? We got Scarlet Wave, the Gut Sailor, that is fucking brutal. Uh, Looty Lucy. Wild Lucy, okay, good. Lady Fury, and Baroness of the Seas. <laughs> One Piece Wielder. <laughs> 
Alright, uh, you guys pick. Alright, so one vote for the Scarlet Wave, one for Looty Lucy. <laughs> one piece wheel. <laughs> That's just a joke, I'm not actually giving that. <laughs> I'm removing it. Ain't no one piece for her. <laughs> No, Zach, I'm not giving no one piece. Go back to Scarlet Wave. Since we gave her a strong and kind personality, Scarlet Wave. Both deadly and beautiful. Mm, facts, facts. Baroness of the Sea actually sounds cool. Alright, so... One vote for Scar Scarlet Wave, that's if Zach does not go back there. One vote for Luti Lucy, one vote for Baroness of the Seas. What you guys like? Do you like her because of her peg leg? Look at that peg leg, bruh. It's wood. Scarlet Wave sounds epic, not gonna lie. So that means you're you're insinuating that you're voting Scarlet Wave, so uh... Yeah, what you, what you like? I hope you got some personality in mind for later and some uh, key information like uh, Nah, not key information, but like, uh, just simple information, such as, uh... Lucy likes loot. Well, that's fucking obvious, but... <laughs> yeah, you know, stuff like that. Why? Oh. Well, uh, winner, Scarlet Wave. <clears throat> With three votes, I think. Has majority, but you know, I can't count, I'm, I'm dumb. Alright, we got Lucy Lutenberg with Scarlet Wave. What I'm not. <laughs> Fuck you, Zach. Uh. I got a fella, even like a scheme on how these three met in a bizarre manner. So a pirate, a, an Ohio businessman, and a dwarf meet at the bar. What? <laughs> okay, I can't think. <clears throat> oh Hannah Gustav, what the fuck? Anyways, I ain't reading that. That don't exist until later. I was just telling you to keep it in your mind, but uh, fuck you. Um. <coughs> All right, where were we? All right, so the bucket head, Ohio businessman. He ain't got hair. This poorly spells Ohio, you can see the O, the H, the I, and the O here. Look like some, uh, some ancient Ohio artifact. Alright, so here are the names. We got Buck, Bucky, Heisenbuck, that is the spelling I saw. Danio and Tyler. Those three names, those first three names were just literally because he has a bucket. So, what do you guys think? Buck, Bucky, Heisenbuck, Danio, Tyler. Can you add a name? Oh, sure. Oh, my bad. I forgot. Uh, you got any name suggestions? Go ahead. Whenever you're ready. Uh, same goes with the nicknames. But there, I believe you don't need to add more nicknames. They're too much. 
Bucketburg, White, Buck Bacon, Bucketeer, Ohio Businessman, Buckner, Master of Stonks. Yeah, I totally forgot the Stonks meme existed. Up until uh, it was suggested. <sighs> the meeting makes sense. Scarlet wants to celebrate new bounty, Stonksman wants a rest, and Dwarf Dude wants to stop by because he enjoys a nice country. Wow, that actually makes sense. <laughs> How about maybe Bucket Head Guy met Lucy on a mission where Bucket Head Guy was hired to kill her? Wait, so this guy's an assassin? I mean, that's what you want him to be? I mean, we already made Ari, who is like. Let's say she's uh, on the surface, she's just. Uh, a normal secretary or some stuff. Just a normal businesswoman. And uh, on the other side, she works a second job where she fucking takes uh, contracts for killing. Sometimes killing. But uh, let's say it's elimination, not killing. Be more friendly with the kids. But yeah. Um, Gustavo, are you not adding any name? Where's your name, Gustavo? I thought you were gonna suggest something. Why are you letting me down more than rock bottom? <laughs> Bork. <laughs> Bork. <laughs> Oh, you were just asking. Meh, buzz you. Uh, Alright then, voting time then. Um, Buck, Bucky, Heisenbuck, Daniel, Tyler. Or, let's put my... Uh, I actually don't have a name. I suck at names. This is... This stream is definitely... Not to compensate for me not knowing how to do names. It's for democracy. Name him Jorge. Why, why did I read it like that? Is it supposed to be Jorge or George? <laughs> Cast your votes. I'm just gonna put this in chat. Man, now you put in Gabriel. Gabriel. When you say Gabriel, sounds like a sk the cool st skater dude from uh, down the street. But when you say Gabriel, instant angel. Why are you giving these names? I thought you're gonna vote. Timothy. Eisenbuck. Wait, so I... We're stuck at a st stalemate here. So why are you named Bucky? Definitely not because of the bucket. I make big books. Alright, so... Uh, Jesus, what exactly? Which name exactly, brother? Two people want Gabriel. 
one wants Bucky, and one wants Timothy. Are you locking in your votes? Because at this point, uh, Gabriel will win. Man, I swear, if we're making a Breaking Bad scene with this dude and this dude, literally gave him a Walter White stash. Man, I'm I'm, I'm gonna cry. Gabriel sounds hella goofy. So, uh, that's it. Two people want Gabriel, one wants Timothy, and one wants Bucky. Is this it? Going once. <coughs> I do not have cancer. Going twice. Man, you can't rock, paper, scissors this. And Gabriel it is, god damn. <coughs> Man, I need to drink some water. <sighs> Sheesh. You're really doing rock paper shaking. <laughs> you you're fucking stupid, Zach. You really think text? Rock, paper, scissors works. You can't trust the other person to send it on time. Alright, I'ma drink water. I'ma mute myself as I am providing ASMR. Okay, I pull up. Oh, um, yeah, the name's chosen. I don't think I could. Are you guys in favor of changing Gabriel to? Yeah. You know, democracy works wonders. When one, when more than half of the people decide on something. Okay, you suck, Zach. <laughs> you know, you, you you just let uh, Somali here down. You you were sad. You were bad. Oh well. All right then. So on to the nicknames. We have Bucketberg, White. Buck Bacon, Bucketeer, Ohio Businessman, Buckmill, and Master of Stonks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven names. Nicknames, I mean. Oh, yeah. Cast your votes. Alright, I'm gonna just uh, wait a bit while you, uh, I mean, while I, while you guys decide on something. I'm gonna wait on your vote. White. Gabriel, the Ohio businessman. Made in Ohio! <laughs> Bucketeer sounds like a match made for Matilda. Uh, 
fuck was that? Never mind. Um, white. One vote for white. One vote for Ohio businessman. Hmm? Two. Um, nothing else. More irrelevant things from uh, this man here. Very irrelevant. You ever just wonder if he knows I'm talking to him? So sad. He don't even behave well in the chat. I'm pretty sure at some point he will just uh, go to the chat and be like, Yo, my brothers, I have to make a public announcement. That I will pray. But yeah, I don't know. I don't even know why does he have to announce it. I'm aware he's here. I want him to hear it. That sounds dirty. Man, where are the votes at? Gustavo wants Ohio businessman. Zach wants white. Franz Dime wants a bucketeer. We're at the stalemate here. If it were up to me, I think I'd go with the... Honestly, I don't know. None of, the, none of them stick out well to me. Oh. Can someone break the tie between white Bucketeer and Ohio businessman. What is this music? Uh, this music is made by. Oops, I forgot to put it in the chat. I forgot to pin it. This music is, uh, you know, music uh, made by. By Devon XM 1014 on uh, Newgrounds. I I have to pin the message first. Give me a bit of time. I, I... Okay, so music you hear is from Devon XM 1014 on Newgrounds. Okay, I'm gonna just uh, pin it and let's get back here. Alright, now what happened here? I went Ohio businessman. Ohio businessman. Jesus, okay, everyone wants Ohio businessman. Negotiate in Ohio. This guy is so American, you can see it by his name, Gabriel. Alright, so let's move on to the next character. We have the Dwarf Man. Who is bald? They made him bald. You know, see how bald it is? It's completely blue. But then they give him a helmet. Alright, so we have four names we have Humphrey, Laos, Darwin, and Krub. Definitely not rearranged, Brock. For real. I. I I highly doubt it is just uh, Brock but rearranged. Uh, yeah. So yeah, you guys vote. Eggdog from Discord suggested Humphrey and I shall come to. Man. Alright, let's see the votes. One for Humphrey. One for Crab. One for Leos. Leos. Two for Crab. Two for Humphrey. Alright, we're not a stalemate here. Between Humphrey and Crab. And so much potential on Laos, but uh 
you know, the democracy. <laughs> Can't complain, can I? We have a tie between Humphrey and Crob. And it looks like the the vote is uh you can't even spell Humphrey right got there. And looks like the name will be Humphrey. Man, this guy is uh, just your regular uh, urban dwarf rather than those, uh, you know, fairy tale dwarves. Anyways, moving on. Uh, nicknames or title? We got Smith of the North Pole. You can see the reference. Dwarf Destroyer. Uh, the Secret Eighth Dwarf. Fucking Snow White, bro. <laughs> Ah, Zoro, you get your ass here. Okay, where were we? Uh, Elven Rocky and Designer of War. You know, I find it racist that you think all dwarves are blacksmiths. Just kidding. But uh, yeah, that's up to you, not me. Haha. Uh -huh. Who am I to complain? I'm, I'm probably a woman. Ah! So are you? You get your ass. Your chat bubble. I don't wanna, you know, expose this man to the world. Until he sends a me until he sends a photo, then uh... Oh, there goes his name. Anyways, uh, let's see what you guys. Secret 8th Dwarf. Maybe racist for calling him designer for, but am I wrong? Nah, uh, you're not wrong. You know, when I make a joke, I might try, I might try gaslighting you. My jokes are gaslights. I got a cool nickname. How about the 11th commandment? Where the hell did that come from? But sure, I guess. Smurf dwarf. For real? You are so desperate in making a Mary Smurf, huh? Yo, the smithing Smurf! Can you Smurf up uh, some uh, some arms so that we can uh, Smurf the living hell out of Gargamel? Yeah. <laughs> the Irish Blue Mole. What the fuck? Come on. Are you guys gonna vote or, or what? That ain't a good nickname, Zoro Penis Wins. Well, I know it's not a nickname, but a bad nickname. Or just the Irish. Yeah, okay, that's just. <laughs> Did I read that right? The Eminem that was left on the table for two weeks. <laughs> oh, um, Mr. Fran. We, I don't think we even... Uh went through much just decided Humphrey that's it we're still cast your votes damn it what nickname <clears throat> what do you guys uh vote Make sure you resend your votes because you know I don't look back. You just gotta keep going forward. Don't look back. Can you even look back? You're probably not obese, are you? Can you look back? Look at your toes. <laughs> Blades with a Z. 
that nickname? I mean, we decided on this goofy ass Humphrey. All right, so the secret eighth dwarf, eighth dwarf, two votes for the eighth dwarf. Eleventh commandment, Smith of the North Pole. All right, so currently we have two votes for the eighth, the secret eighth dwarf. Should definitely call him the Irish Mole. Why? Fuck off. Uh, anyways, uh, probably he was humpy. <laughs> Man, we're gonna establish that. Uh, all right, be right back. I thought I muted that. Oh wait, I did not. I'm stupid. Oh, one hour. I pull up! Okay, now what? Still uh, two votes on the secret eighth dwarf? Well, since no other votes are get- no other options are getting two votes, I will wrap it up in, uh, you know, three... Two. I'm doing it slowly because there's a big ass stream delay. One. Secret Ace Dwarf is officially the. Alright, that's the nickname. God damn it. Can't believe you really let this slide through. Secret Ace Dwarf. It's Humphrey, the Secret Ace Dwarf. What does he do for uh, Snow White? I don't know. Uh, makes shit. <coughs> he humps. Okay, fuck you. Uh... <laughs> Alright, since we're done with the uh, fellow's names, let me just copy. Actually, forgot copying it. So we have Lucy here. We have two options for now. We have the strong and kind. And depressed. Um, <coughs> you can suggest more. Give more suggestion, more personality. She needs more personality. Okay. Now moving on here, we have... What's his name? Gabriel. With the Ohio citizen mindset. Goofy ah, personality. Or uh, Deltarune crew from Deltarune Undertale. Well, I'm, re well, I'm stupid. I can't tell them apart. Depressed plus kind. Man, what the fuck? Make Paracle have a gloomy resting place, but actually very cheerful. That is already better writing than my first character. Damn. Alright, for now for this. Grumpy. That's it. Humphrey, the, gr the grumpy... Secret Eighth Dwarf, come on, give him some personality. Suggest now. Irish. What the fuck is that personality? It's like saying, Yo, what is Sultan's personality? He is Filipino. I'm sorry, what? Come on, personality. Yeah, even an Ohio citizen is specific enough. 
Irish is a whole country. Ohio is just a state. Is it a state? I guess so. Yeah, but uh... Angry on the outside, kind on the inside. Mmm, Sundere? Just kidding. <laughs> Uh, angry outside Kind inside Make Humphrey have a secret personality where he's actually cheerful and emotional Basically a soft side on the inside though Wait, tough and scarred on the outside Okay, well here there's just the same thing <laughs> Grumpy but cool Uncle Dwarf personality. And at this point, uh, it's about uh, what's this? C -c 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 I forgot the word. Synergy, yeah, it's about synergy. Okay, so cool, cool Uncle Dwarf. like the dwarves here at my place. Uh, you want a drink? Uh, <coughs> I don't know. Alright, so while you guys have thought up of some goofy shit, <laughs> general personality for them, uh, make him that what uncle angry as fuck, but when he's drunk, he's the best one. Once he's sober. So angry as hell when he's drunk and the best when he's sober. I could go to the background information. Alright, so uh make Ohio citizen an alcoholic. That's not general personality, that's more of background info, but I'll add it. Not that I'm in not that I drink. Gonna insert so what all these three like drinking rum whatever uh, you really want to make her fucking depressed jesus christ bro it's like she won't even be sailing seas no more she's just gonna lock herself in the room just what kind of uh, interests do you have, Zach? Yo, I want this big booba girl to have big booba, but I want her to be suicidal so that, you know, it's limited edition. You know what I'm saying? Come on, Zach, what the f that's fucked up. Wait, her name's not Matilda, she's uh, Lucy. It would ruin it if she's depressed. Add, um, okay, humbleness. Make her strong willed, contrary to. contrary to uh, depressed. Alright, so yeah, I'll just be mashing some of them. Those that don't belong will just uh, be yeeted, or those that are similar. Isn't being humble just one of the uh, sub-branches of uh, being kind? If you're kind, you're humble. If you're humble, you're not kind. Man, yeah, fuck you, Zach. <coughs> okay, uh, where were we? I'm not gonna entertain Zach's horny. Uh, so, uh, yeah, so. <coughs> Hmm. 
I mean, here is general personality, but uh, I guess I could change that. Boop, personality. Alright, so she's a strong and kind pirate who does not steal. Oh, so much for a pirate. Just kidding. <laughs> you got a jar of dirt. <coughs> I pressed this epic background lore for her. Bro, you, you're just talking about Arya from, you know, from A and J. Fucking sad and lonely because of uh, my childhood. Wow. Well, but actually, I'm uh, gonna. I will be eliminating traits of the personality if it doesn't match up with the background info later. Oh, uh, yeah, that's it. For now, we're leaving Lucy and... And then, how about this? How about Mr. Gabriel? The Ohio businessman. Of course, he needs to be an Ohio citizen or else he cannot survive. And he is goofy and a chromer. You want him to be a Sigma? Okay, sure, I guess. Sigma male, Sigma dick. Damn, Zuro be making mask model for real after how many fucking months? Jeez. Oh uh, yeah, no other traits. I'd rather so go with this guy. He's Humphrey is grumpy but angry on the outside, kind inside, cool uncle dwarf. Careless. He has the muscle brain in mind. Okay, he's so careless. Oh wait, lore wise, okay. And yeah, that that fits anyway. Spam from personality on the bucket head. Didn't you make him Cromer? Come on, set set your shit on the uh, one thing. Separate. Hmm. Well, since we have some personality there, you guys better, you guys better build the uh, background information that matches the personality, okay? Or else I'm eliminating either that background info or the personality. The trait, I mean. Who do we start with? Motherfucker, you're the one suggesting two, two characters. Now, what else are you gonna put? Uh. Just whatever. I got some for Lucy. May I start? Alright! Start with Lucy. Background info could be that she's the descendant of Captain Hook. That? I don't know about that. Hello new fellas, we're just writing the lore and background info of Lucy right now. You can just put simple details like uh, she prefers tuna over barracuda. 
some shit. I don't know. Fucking <laughs> right. There's a mosquito in my room. Or you can put for uh, Gabriel. He is racist towards mosquitoes. I don't know. That's up to you. You can either put one sentence background info or paragraph. For instance, she is the granddaughter of a famous and feared pirate man. But after many years of fighting and pirating, she got hella depressed because of a last mission that got all... Wait. That got her all she needed to leave. She likes Saitama for real. Find the treasure land. I don't know what the fuck to talk about again. <coughs> What what the fuck are you guys putting here? We're talking about Lucy. Keep Gabriel for later. Okay, so... Can I copy? Why can't I copy? This is Rosista. I can't copy. But uh, yeah, let me just... Copy... Where, 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 where? Give me that. 